going to teach you how to make zebra popcorn. Um, first, we need all of our ingredients. So, tell us what the ingredients are. So, for we need butter, um, sweetened condensed milk, mm -hmm. corn syrup. Corn syrup, um, chocolate, chocolate, um, popcorn kernels, and sugar, and more chocolate. We also need, if you have one, a popcorn maker. And a, a bowl to put the popcorn in, and um, um, a, a cooking sheet to put the popcorn on when you're all finished. And so, let's start cooking. First, we need to pop some popcorn, and so that what we need to do is to put one cup in and then start it, and then pop all that one. And then put another cup in and then pop all that. And you should use a big pot like this and always have an adult an adult around to um to make sure um that you um because you have to use the stuff and then you put the stove on medium low so now we should put now we'll put the ingredients in. do the butter first And also remember, you can use regular sugar, sugar, or powdered sugar. Now we stir it. So we, um, first we wait until all the butter's melted. Now it's time for our next step. We put the sweet and condensed milk and corn syrup in. Put that in, and we'll stir. And now let's do three tablespoons of um, corn syrup. Now we stir it for 10 minutes. Make sure you stir all the way to the bottom and don't stop stirring because it will burn. So that's what I say. Now the caramel stone is done, so we need to start getting the other stuff ready, which is putting parchment paper on. Have an adult do this next part because the um the caramel's gotta be really hot. So just pour the caramel. Have an adult pour the caramel into the popcorn. Okay. And they
So now that um the 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 caramel is set up, um we're gonna make the chocolate. You can melt it on your stove or in the microwave. Kind of funny. <laughs> make sure you tell them what to do each step. So I take it out of the microwave. And you stir it. You take it out of the microwave or off the stove. Then you just kind of flick it off on there. So the, you, to make it zebra popcorn, you want a different color. Today we're going to use today we're going to use blue and you don't need to put as much as the normal chocolate because it burns easily and if you put it in the microwave you have to put it um take it out and stir it for every 30 seconds So you can put it in the um, freezer for like 20 minutes, or you can let it sit for um, an hour and a half. The last thing to do is to break up your popcorn into little chunks so that people can eat it. Easily. 